Hi, this is Danielle Roberts with Blue Moon Estate Sales of Northwest Houston. We are coming to you from Magnolia this week, where we're having our sale this weekend on Friday and Saturday, January 21st and 22nd. We are in the Montgomery Trace neighborhood. The address will go live on Thursday morning at 9 o'clock. There is no appointment required for this sale. So let's step inside. As we step inside the house, you see this is a large two-story home. Immediately in the foyer, you will see this is where we've put our double D jackets, our crazy ties, the Camaro jacket, some Harley vest. And these jackets, y'all, are just gorgeous. They were custom made for the owner. She just doesn't, she has a lot of them. She just doesn't wear this wear it that many anymore beautiful jewelry cabinet lots of drawers as we come in the office you'll immediately see this nice desk this is a three piece it can be taken apart so you can put things in other areas you have a bookcase the desk and then the filing cabinet really nice sturdy wood that's the filing drawers. Okay, we also have these really cool lamps. Let me turn one on for you here. Some Stetson cowboy hats and cases. There's three different hats. This really nice bar and wine rack. And this over here is an antique accordion. Check that out, y'all. Awesome. Okay, let's go into the living room. You can see we're still setting up. Those are some of our buckets. We have cute Mr. Butler here. He's also antique. As we go into the living room, we see some Jim Shore, some Precious Moments. There's a curio cabinet with more collectibles, Jim Shore and Precious Moments. This large TV with the shelf. It's a Sony. We have the Poke Audio sound bar with the subwoofer and then the DVD player. This is a 3D DVD player that comes with the glasses. as we move into the kitchen so nothing in the cabinets is going to be for sale in this sale it's only the things on the counters but there is still a lot to choose from we have all this nice pampered chef look at all these pieces back here some of them are brand new i don't even know if they've ever been used we have the enamel glazed and then the regular pampered chef Some crystal. And this collection of Longa Burger baskets is probably one of the largest I have seen. And she doesn't just have normal baskets. She's got the ones that have the inserts in them. They have the carriers with them. She's got, I love this one, pitcher. So many varieties of the baskets. They're just beautiful. And they don't make these anymore. The company actually went out of business, so you can't even get them. We have lots of cake decorating supplies. And then over here, we have this really great set of Santa Fe dishes. These are by Mara. And they have different patterns on them. So you can see the patterns here on the mugs. They're just beautiful. Some coasters, another set of dishes, some great barware. Wine opener, silver plate, ice bucket. Okay, let's go to the bedroom. In the master bedroom, walk in and the first thing we see is some decorations. 
some Christmas decor. But wait until you see these. This is the Department 56 Christmas Village. And these are not your average pieces. This dairy barn is precious. The Harley. I've never seen that one in person before. So lots of Department 56. We have a nice TV in the corner. And then this furniture. This is Bassett furniture. So this tall dresser. The drawer slides so nice. There's two nightstands, a tall dresser, and the bed. This is a queen bed. It comes with a Tempur-Pedic mattress. It's adjustable. And then this quilt, you guessed it, it's Astro's. This was actually made for a charity auction that the owner purchased. It is beautiful. Okay, let's go to the dining room and then we'll head upstairs. So in the dining room, we have this nice light colored wood table. It's in great condition. It does have a leaf, so you can take the leaf out and make it smaller. Nice light covered chairs, no stains, great shape. Plant stand, this beautiful cross. This is a nice heavy wood cross. Some more plant stands as we go around the room. This great uh, silverware cabinet, it's all lined. You can put other things in, it doesn't have to be silverware. That's what was in it. There is a set of uh, sterling silver flatware at this sale, as well as other sterling pieces. Some of them are here on the table and the majority will be set up at our register because they are sterling. This nice china hutch cabinet also matches the table in the light wood. And this, Noah's Ark, I gotta get close so you guys can see. Can you see it's quilted and it's framed in a shadow box. Again, this was handmade special for the owner from a friend of hers who sells these. This one's beautiful. So let's head upstairs. I also want to tell you, we have a large collection of jewelry in this house. We have a lot of David Yurman. We have uh, other designers, John Hardy. Um, lots of gold and silver, semi-precious and precious stones. I will show you that at the end of the video. We have his Klein Brothers cedar chest. <coughs> If you guys are familiar with the area, you know the name Klein, originally came from Germany. We have this little girl's set of Thomasville furniture, complete with a nightstand and the bed. It's got this really nice design on the end. Again, Thomasville, solid wood, there's also a bookcase and a desk. Some extra comforters in the closet. We have another Tiffany lamp here. This is one of those ring light type things for doing your videos. Let's come down the hall to the second bedroom. And here we have a queen size sleigh bed, also a Tempur-Pedic mattress. I should mention every single bed in this house has a Tempur-Pedic mattress. And they're all in great condition, very clean. This one, I don't think it's hardly even been slept on. Some suitcases and oh my gosh, I have to turn this on. There's the button. This lamp. There it is, I apologize. This banana leaf lamp here, if you can see the leaves on the shade are real banana leaves. It's beautiful, especially lit up. 
and it goes great with this table, this rustic, you know, Texas star table. This is the kind of stuff that you find like at uh, the rustic store on uh, 1488 and very expensive. So this is what is good about shopping our estate sales is you can get really high end furniture for great deals and it's in great condition. It hasn't been sitting in somebody's garage. It's been, you know, used and kept in the home. That's an extra bedroom that was never hardly even slept in. And here we, the game room, we have this entertainment center. Now this entertainment center, as you can see, we pulled it apart a little bit to show you. It's actually three pieces. So it doesn't have to be this huge piece in the middle of your living room. You could actually make the sides bookcases in another location of the house, which is really nice. We have this set of couches, a love seat and a couch. We have another chest, cedar chest. This one is a lane. It's got stuff on top of it, so I'm not going to open it for the video, but if you come by, you're welcome to take a look. And look at these collector magazines. Huge book collection. Kids books, lots of kids books. Probably the whole Dr. Seuss collection in here. Magic Treehouse, we have Beverly Cleary. Junie B. Jones, all of these, you know, story time books for your kids, Pat the Bunny. But then we also have a lot of best selling titles for you adults and DVDs. And sometimes when we get a lot of books like this, people don't notice the beautiful bookshelves that they're on. But look at these bookshelves, they're so nice. These are not your particle board bookshelves folks these are nice sturdy bookshelves we have some Disney lithographs framed up there karaoke machine some Legos and this lamp is a cool lamp nice statement piece it actually has a dimmer on the switch so you can dim it down as well very cool piece we have some sporting equipment treadmill, the weight bench with the weights, more workout equipment. Y'all, it's January. It's time to get those resolutions. All right, so that's the whole of the house. I'm going to take a little break and I'm going to walk outside and show you the barn. Okay, so we're out here at the barn now. So I can show you these things. First thing you see is this nice big ladder. Ladders are always great. These nice big coolers, there's two. There's a Rubbermaid and an Igloo. These are very, very clean. Very clean inside. We have this Zep parts cleaner with an extra chemical. Traeger pellet grill and we have this water holder another grill a George Foreman a sack of tires these are for a Jeep and if you look at the photos you'll get all the details about what kind of Jeep it's for or what size they are I'm sorry you got a oxygen tank this is a full-size oxygen tank so this is not for medical this is for you know, blow torches and, and tools and, and for, you know, out for the garage and stuff like that, but they're very expensive. So finding one that you can just have refilled is great. We're gonna walk over here, a couple bicycles. We have some of these great outdoor lighted yard, big angel. golf clubs, a flag, some medical equipment, a tool, tool chest, there's an air compressor, and then some more tools over here. And a 2017 Chevy grill, if anyone's got one of those trucks and needs a new grill, I got you. All right, so next I'm gonna show you the jewelry.
Okay, so here we are with the jewelry. I'm gonna kind of walk around the table to show you everything. So this first part here is costume jewelry. Lots of nice, chunky statement necklaces with gorgeous beads. We've got some Betsy Johnson in here. Just a variety of nice, high-end costume jewelry and earrings. Okay, and then in the case, and these will be in the case at the sale too, at the register, this is all sterling or gold or precious semi, precious stones. This is all the real stuff. So right here we have the collection from Hope Faith Miracle Jewelry from Kristen Alfonso. You might remember her from Days of Our Lives. Then we have our Robert Yerman collection. These beautiful silver necklaces with gold accent and pearl and turquoise. Just gorgeous. Several different kinds of pendants to choose from. One has diamonds even. And then we have the ropes to put the pendants on. These pearl earrings. Next we move over and we have Judith Ripka. This top necklace here would make a gorgeous uh, necklace for a bride. It's all inlaid with pearls. And then this is the custom jewelry. I'm going to say her name wrong every time. Dion Mat Matluf. I put her picture in the post so you can look her up. All of these are handmade by her. These are earrings and then we have a ton of rings. I don't see if you can see these rings. These are chunky rings and the ones up here are actually stackers. So you can stack multiples of them together. Some onyx, some beautiful turquoise, all different stones. And then this is a brooch, uh, like a pendant. And it can be a brooch too, so it can be either or. Some more earrings from her. And we have Caroline Pollock. Got some nice cuffs with matching earrings. And then these two John Hardy necklaces. These are 16 inch and the class do have gold on them as well. Silver. As we go around the table, this is our set of sterling silver flatware with a place setting of eight with serving pieces. It's in beautiful condition. This case over here is also all sterling or gold or semi-precious stones. You see we have some James Avery, we have some Kendra Scott, we have Pandora, some cute little Western earrings. You know, rodeo is coming up and a lot of this big chunky jewelry is so popular at the rodeo and a lot of this was actually purchased at the rodeo because the uh, owners of the home volunteered for the rodeo for many, many, many years and of course took advantage of the markets there. This little case is full of watches. So we have some Harley Davidson, some Seiko, Mickey Mouse. This is actually a Tussaud. A few more watches. These are some more fun ones, and then we have our Rockets drawer here at the bottom. We have some costume bracelets and cuffs. Not all of these are costumes. Some are, some are not. The ones with the, uh, the stones on them, these are not. The red one's a Brahmin. This is a Kendra Scott some Anne Klein, more silver pieces. 
And then we'll move into our coin collections. We have a stack of proof sets. And these proof sets come with the uh, regular coins and the quarters. And then we have uh, proofs of just the quarters. These are all of our international coins divided by country. Some uh, Susan B. Anthony 1999 proofs. Some Mexico set. Some older proof U.S. We have some United Kingdom proof and some paper money. Most of which of these are not in print anymore, so they're worth a little bit more. All right. So again, our sale is going to be this Friday from nine to three, and also Saturday from nine to three. There is no appointment necessary for this sale. We will put numbers on the door an hour in advance. And the address will be released Thursday morning at 9 a.m. Hope to see you there.